picks up over the Sri Lankan issue continues. Now, Ajay Lalita, AIA DMK chief, has attacked, attacked the Congress for dubbing her Elam demand anti national. Ajay uh, Lalita has said that she is a patriot to the core and she questioned the need for her credentials. Uh, Jaya claims her demand was based on the humanitarian crisis and that she was not demanding a separate nation be carved out of India. Uh, Jaya Lalita's attacks uh, come just uh, days after the Congress uh, dubbed her Elam demand anti-national. Let's go across to Dhania Rajendran for the latest. Dhania, we're just looking at the statement uh, from the AIA DMK chief. Just one important point she's made apart from attacking the Congress. She's saying that she never demanded a separate nation. Well, she says she never demanded a separate nation within India. That's what she says. When I did not ask for bifurcation uh, of uh, uh, India, then why are you dubbing me as anti-national? I was talking about a separate nation in Sri Lanka. I was saying this only out of concern of the humanitarian crisis. So that's another battle starting here in Tamil Nadu, this time between the Congress and the AIDMK chief. The AIDMK chief obviously livid that the Congress uh, dubbed her as anti-national. Two days ago, in a, a campaign rally in E Road, AIDMK chief had made a dramatic uh, U-turn in her stand on the Sri Lankan issue and said that she now supports a separate homeland for Tamils in Sri Lanka. The Congress, of course, called it anti-national, saying that if another country came and told that India should bifurcate, then that will be uh, not welcomed by India. The same way, we cannot ask Sri Lanka to bifurcate its land. Uh, so now, uh, AIDMK chief obviously has taken exception to these statements by the Congress, uh, saying that the, these leaders really have no right to call her anti-national. Another battle really panning out here in Tamil Nadu, Tamil Nadu. All right, thank you.